Hey there, everyone. This is Hellcow. It's December 17th. We're kind of like super deep in at this point. Like, we're approaching like the end of the mid game here. What are we going to expect? I don't know, but there's door 17 inside that cat plant cat's ear. It's a combo! Castilla the Cabra! I gotta press drop item. So we got Tangy with a level. And then we got Polypsia and Brother with a gift, and Polypsia is always just a sweet part of the festivities with like these lovely homemade craft. And I also got unofficial pirated third third uh, party DLC, so we'll go in order, but we'll start with Tangy. Oh my god, <laughs> it's the stars, but another format of star. I have 55 lives, so I hope that's gonna be enough. Uh, it's this goat that lives here, huh? So this- oh no! I'm saying things has gone through too- <laughs> Well, we got ourselves a- uh, yeah, this'll be- I mean, this is mentioning a scapegoat. I'm gonna press a switch, obviously. Like, what else do you think I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run around this path. And we're gonna hit a switch again and again. That's what we do. Check it out. I'm Santa and I'm gonna go in this door. We got a weird little sign that opened the door. The door that says red, ornate, and admissible. The other leads back to the start. Got it. Reset. Exists. I want a block. So we do this. So maybe. No, we want to go back here. Maybe. I don't know. It doesn't make a difference. I can go here. Excellence. Do that, throw a mushroom, then do it again. Uh, then I'm small now. On these, oh, I can't jump with these on. Well, that's just rude. Uh, I just went in the non ornate door. Okay, that's just kind of a lot. Okay, so too bad that it resets the music, honestly. So you do this, so you can do that, so you can escape. Now I understand everything that's presented to me. Yeah. All right, so... No, see, that didn't work. I had a plan, but it didn't work out. Hmm, how would you do that? Because, yeah, like, the issue is... Whoops, no, that's not it. Hmm. Because, yeah, see, that's my issue, is that if I jump... To throw it up. Ah! And I mean, that could almost work. If I, like. Ah, uh, maybe. Like, I would need, like, a running jump to be able to do that. Hmm. Because, yeah, there it doesn't go high enough, but if I jump up and throw it, I. Okay, what if. See, what if I throw it up during my down falling and give myself enough time to throw it then? Uh, even that's like not free, but it's the clearest thing I can see here. But like that is not really working right now. I just don't see what else. But no, like you just throw too fast. It's not doing what I want. So I get the feeling that that's not what I'm supposed to do, but then what? Okay, there it were. It was just a matter of throwing that the exact right side that I wanna. Alright, here we make things a bit harder, but my thing fell in here. Yeah, there's nothing else I can do. Okay, so like it's really unfortunate that it makes a full break like that. So, if I don't want to... I can hit it once, basically. Alright, got it. So that was the puzzle. Now I can hit it all day long again if I, if I want to. Do that. Do that. Hey, look at that. It's eyeball time! Okay, um... I think I will do it this way. We're taking things very safely here. That's okay. Then we can climb up this wall. 
Never thought I'd see the day where ascension on the vertical will lend me to the highway. Look at that. I made a Christmas door for me and you. Here we got some platforming and also new parachute. Alright, so, uh, it's a classic setup that I classically find difficult. And, uh, okay, so even though we got a Zui on the previous room, that doesn't mean that we still don't, like, restart up here. I guess it doesn't matter which eyeball you hit. Ugh. As long as it's one of them. We did it. We figured it out. Ugh. Rude. Yay, did it. Figured, uh, yeah, so... Let's go wait for you. There we go. We go in the door. I guess I'm just gonna go down here. Yeah, wrap around. Here we go. That's what we do. My name is this person. Okay, now I'm here. I want to hit this. There we go. Then I don't know where I'm going to go. Yeah, where am I going to go? I can go here in the corner, yo. It's like, if I fall down here, I just end up here, which lets me press this button here, alright. Which lets me climb up back here, I think I understand, but why would I want to do any of that? Now I can go up here, my friend, got it! Video games exist! I don't know what is going on, I could just leave now. So that's, uh... Sprite go through block, I'm guessing? So, like, what do I gain by doing that? Okay, I see. You can do that, you can do that. This is entirely for the Vegimoon. Vegimoon, wow! We did it! I saw the puzzle. There's a girl! Oh, it's Woo! Shh, be careful. Oh, jeez, what happened? Everything is blowing up! Yeah, panic! Panic! Um, oh no! <laughs> oh, little mousy. Yeah, that would be them. They're missing the cute hat, but that's fine. It's tiny little no beard Santa. So yeah, the way everything was rumbling and the walls were moving, that was an extended like a scapegoat thing. Man. <laughs> Uh, I remember Escape Go. It was ah, uh, his hat. Finally, yeah. I love the painting up there <laughs> of the goat. Uh, <laughs> oh, there's a lot of small touches in reference to that game. That was real good. How? Well. I managed to die on this screen. <laughs> All right, let's go on down to the third party. I'm gonna end with Polyptia and brother. All right, so let's see how this goes. All right, there we go. Maverick Christmas present. No, not kind of Maverick. Ah, pies, <laughs> pies on creation. Pisons creations? There's several ways to interpret your name. It's not the first time I see it though, but I feel like it's the first time I I I I I I it's like things the first time I have to say it out loud. Anyways, hi! Hey, hi! Hey there, Rao Cow! This is someone. Thank you again for another year of Let's Plays and Infinite Spinball! I think last year I wanted to contribute something, but I didn't know if I could for sure, so I tried to stay away from the official present giving just in case I would need to drop out. That been said, I wasn't too sure what to make anyway, but then I thought, hey, VTubers are a thing now. So what if, and now we have this. Uh, I don't know what that is. Let me click on it. I, oh, what? Let me down a little bit. Oh, wow. So it's an... <laughs> It's a owl rig. I mean, that's pretty impressive for what it is, though. I like, like, like how the character is so simple in terms of aesthetic that, um, 
Yeah, I can see it working pretty well with a pretty rudimentary rigging. Ah, uh, that's kind of neat. Now, of course, the issue is that if I were to become a VTuber, the money is all into being an anime girl. So that's probably what I would do. Like, without even attempting to change my voice or anything. But, uh, no, still. That's pretty impressive. Not something I would expect to see exist suddenly. And obviously based off of Blue's design, so shout out to him. Ha! <laughs> wow, so... What a funny convenience. <laughs> Record a little video, just in case you didn't have any way to try it out. But if you have some sort of webcam or phone, feel free to mess around with the thing if you want to. I used VC space for space capture. Yeah, I don't have a camera, sadly. There's not really any major setup you need to do. Basically, just add a model and uh, mess with the setting until it fits the way you move. Um, oh, so, all right. I read ahead a little bit. He said it's okay to give you the URL, so. That's the URL right here. All right, you had enough time to see it. But there we go, a VTuber rig, not what I thought I'd be receiving at any point in time. In any case, much props to the peeps making an official Christmas project and a Merry Christmas to everyone in this community, including me, ow cow, whoa. Also feel free to share the link if you want to, but in case you don't want to, they're spoiled. but I mean, with them being cut off like that, it wouldn't be really of any use, so I went ahead and shared it itself. Huh. Still, I'm surprised that it's to the point where, like, just a single individual can just put them together. Like, that was pretty impressive. Like, like I said, I don't know if it's what I choose if I were to actually do it, but I'm super glad that this exists. If someone wants to put it out there, like, like I don't know, I think it's super neat. Thank you so much for this weird, super unexpected thing. That was wild, and we're not done, so like I said, we got the official gift here by... Here we go. Oh no, you can see my folder names. Um, <coughs> sorry. Day 17, Pelliptia and Brother. Oh well, there's the art, might as well just go ahead and look at the art. Yeah, like I remember last year I got these super, like, well-made little poster cards, and they're still up on my cork wall. Like, the art style of your brother is adorable. And look at that. Still adorable. Happy holidays. We got Demo and Iris and Donuts. Oh yeah, they're eating a pokey. They disassembled and are going to consume this pokey now. <laughs> this is super adorable. Ah, oh, that is real cute. You, you, this is, this is real sweet. I love this. And it got like a special PNG letter. Happy holiday, ow cow! December again already! It's like shouting symbols. What a year 2020 has been. I love that the Advent Christmas thing presses on, even this all digital age. I didn't expect to participate this year, but then my brother out of nowhere drew this super adorable, duper adorables demo fan art. If even if we couldn't print it and send it like we did last year, I knew I had to get it to you somehow. Rayman title. All credit goes to my brother this year. All I did was bother Susie at the 11th hour to try and get this in. So, major props to her as well for letting me somewhat break the deadline rules. As we crash into this new decade with online schooling, remote working, and video call holidays, being able to still participate in this annual event helps retain a bit of normalcy for me. Dash heart. Maybe next year this letter will be a physical paper one, but who knows? Uh, can you... Uh, you, you can't. Okay, there we go. Happy holidays and merry, merry time to you and Ghost of Christmas Ghost as well. Degrees, snowflake, and further in the bottom where you can't see, she signs Pilipia. Ah, thank you for the really sweet words. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. And yeah, I agree. I'm glad that, you know, amidst of it all, we still have some kind of something going. Uh, it just goes to show, you know, you just, as long as there's a will humanity as a species is always going to be able to figure things out 
Thank you, everyone who made something today. I, you know, you know what this thing, you know what, what this, this whole plague ordeal brought out? Everyone's going out there and showing their, um, their creativity and skills, no matter what media they, they use. Like, in the really wide range of abilities we've been seeing for this whole event up to now. And we're gonna keep seeing until the end, I'm sure.